Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and hello. Welcome to the first module of this micro-credential course, the second pillar of Islam, which is prayer. This is the introduction. Salah is the second pillar of Islam. Performing Salah five times daily is compulsory for all Muslims. It gives us an opportunity to communicate with Allah the Almighty, remember Him, show our gratitude to Him with the act of prostration being the moment we are closest to Him. Salah is a gift for every believer and it is the first thing accounted for on the Day of Judgment. Salah is an integral part of the lifestyle of a Muslim. Through prayer, Muslims are required each day to ponder on the verses of the Quran, the Shahada or the Declaration of Faith and Allah's attributes. Muslims across the world unite in prayer at five specified times each day in the direction of the Kaaba in Mecca as a means of connecting to Allah the Almighty and their purpose in life which is to remember and worship Him. Muslims should steadfast in their prayers. As Allah the Almighty said in the Holy Quran, A'udhu Billahi Minash Shaitanir Rajim Wa Aqimu Salata Wa Atu Zakah Wa Raka'u Ma'ar Raki'in And be steadfast in prayer. Practice regular charity and bow down your heads with those who bow down or in worship. Allah the Almighty also said in the Holy Quran, A'udhu Billahi Minash Shaitanir Rajim, Inna salata kanat ala al-mu'minina kitaban mawkuta. Surely, the salah at fixed hours, means of the day and night, has been enjoined upon the believers. Importance of praying salah on time can be understood by this hadith. Abdullah asked the Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Which deed is the dearest to Allah? He replied, To offer the prayers at their early stated fixed times. Sahih Bukhari 5 to 7. Men and women pray the same way as Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam made no distinction and told us all to follow how he prayed. Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, Pray as you have seen me praying. Sahih al Bukhari. 604. Prayer is the shield against evil deeds and bad habits. Allah the Almighty said in the Holy Quran, A'udhu Billahi Minash Shaitanir Rajim, Inna salata tanha anil fahshai wal munkar, wala dhikrullahi akbar, wallahu ya'lamu ma tasna'oon. Indeed, prayer prohibits immorality and wrongdoing and the remembrance of Allah is greater and Allah knows that which you do. Prayer as a source of patience. Allah the Almighty said in the Holy Quran, A'udhu Billahi Minash Shaitanir Rajim, Ya ayyuhal ladhina amanu sta'inu bis sabri was salah, inna allaha ma'as sabirin. O you who have belief, seek help through patience and prayer. Indeed, Allah is with the patient. Brings tranquility to the heart. Allah the Almighty mentioned and said in the Holy Quran, A'udhu Billahi Minash Shaitanir Rajim, Al-Ladhina amanu wa tatma'innu kulubuhum bithikrillah. Ala bithikrillahi tatma'innu al-kuloob. Those who have belief and whose hearts are assured by the remembrance of Allah, unquestionably, by the rem remembrance of Allah, hearts are assured. In one hadith, Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, "Indeed, the first deed by which a servant will be called to account on the day of resurrection is his salah. If it is complete." He is successful and safe, but if it is defective, he has failed and lost. Jami at Tirmizi 413. In another hadith, Rasulullah said, 
between faith and unbelief is abandoning the prayer. Sahih Muslim 82. This is the first module of this micro-credential course. Hope to see you in the next module. Inshallah.